Sallu ala al-Habib sallallahu ta'ala wa sallam. Hadith Islam brothers and viewers, Alhamdulillah azza wa jal, the pious people of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, they are connected with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala through different means and different ways. Some piety comes from their families, from their lineage, from their parents, from their grandparents. And Huzur Ghosi Azam, rahmatullah alayhi, is known as amongst them walis of Allah, whose parents were also pious. The pious family of Huzur Ghosi Azam, Rahmatullah alayhi was that the father of Azur Ghosi Azam was a great wali of Allah. The mother of Azur Ghosi Azam was a great wali of Allah. And we know the very famous story of the person who had an apple and then followed that river where the apple flowed down to get forgiveness for the apple which he ate without the permission of the owner. And that garden was the garden of the grandfather of Azur Ghosi Azam, Rahmatullah alayhi. When he realized that this person has come to ask forgiveness for an apple which he ate, he thought that this person is no ordinary person, that this person is someone who is pious. And then after serving, Father of Azur Ghosi Azam was married to the mother of Azur Ghosi Azam, Rahmatullah alayhi. she was also a great wali of Allah, who had never seen any, any non-mahram, who had never spoken to any nun mehram, who had never committed sins with their eyes or with their hands or with their tongue. When these two great walis of Allah were married, the son was Sheikh Abdul Qadir Jilani, rahmatullah alayhi. Sometimes piety is gained to the pious family members, to the pious parents of that child. And Huzur Ghosi Azam, rahmatullah alayhi, was chosen as a wali of Allah, but also had piety through his father and through his mother. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give us the ability to become pious parents so that our children can become pious also.